Hey everyone, it's Sarah, and I am here with my third layout using the uh, my version of the March Click Kit. So it's a kit that I made um, from my own stash, and I used the March Click Kit as a reference for what I pulled from my own stash. Um, so it's kind of an echo of that. And some of the products are the same, um, not very much of them. Honestly, I only had a couple things um, in my stash from the actual kit, but um, you know, the colors and the feel of it are the same. So I'm going to use these pictures of snowflakes. Um, it has snowed a lot here in New Mexico, which really surprised my husband and I. And we're actually, it's our first winter here, and we're actually hearing that it doesn't normally snow this much. <laughs> um, it does snow every winter, but um, I guess this year it, we got hit pretty hard. Um, so we were in the car going somewhere and um oh i think we took like recycling or something and my husband was emptying um was emptying the recycling into the bins and i look over on my windowsill at our car and i could literally see the snowflakes like in detail i could see what the snowflakes look like and what their design were and i've never seen that before and i've been in snow before so um but i've never like actually looked at a snowflake and seen what it looks like. It's, it was insane. So I took all sorts of pictures, <laughs> got up as close as I could with my phone, and um, it's really cool. Uh, you'll see them really good in the, um, the close-ups that I have at the end for you, but oh my gosh, they were just beautiful. So um, I am using the background paper there is from Sassafras, and it's like a, it's a kind of a creamy with a black, very um, thin floral print on it. And the pink paper that I used to map my photos is from Studio Calico. And um, so I'm working on my title here. And the title is These Snowflakes Look Like Snowflakes. So I'm going to have the first part at the top and the second part at the bottom. And I got that idea from one of my favorite movies of all time, Super Troopers. If you have not seen Super Troopers, do it immediately. It is very adult comedy, so it's um, you have to kind of be okay with that kind of humor. But it is one of the funniest movies I've ever seen. It is so funny. And there was a scene where one of the guys was in the back of a cop car, and he licks the seat. He was on drugs. The, he licks the seat and he says, these snozberries taste like snozberries. <laughs> and I, I just, I don't know. Because when I looked at the snowflakes, I was like, these snowflakes look like snowflakes. That's literally what I said. And I was like, that sounds like Super Troopers. <laughs> so that's what my title is. Um, I hope that didn't confuse you too much. But if you've seen the movie, then I'm sure you know what I'm talking about. Um, so that's going to be my title. And I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to layer it um, on the top and on the bottom there. And I am using that pink doily um, along with that 3x4 card that is from um, one of the Heidi Swap uh, Project Life editions that, came, that she came out with that um, you can get at Michael's. Um, I think, I can't remember which one it's from. <laughs> it's, I think I got two of them. I think it might be the transparent one or something like that. Um, but it has the frame around it is like chipboard and then at the center of it is clear and it has a small pink heart along the bottom. So I like that you can see the doily through it. Um, and then on the bottom there I put that wide piece of black and white stripe washi tape. And I am getting my title stuck down. Those thickers are a black foam thicker and they're called Delight. Um, so I am going to go ahead and put all those down and then the the smaller um, white tile stickers those are from glitz and um, I think they go really really well so now I'm going to use um, a couple of these little tiny texts these are from Cosmo Cricut and um, I'm going to put them inside the frame here as well and um, I used two different ones, um, and all together it says, Believe in the beautiful pieces of life. And I thought that was cute because, like, how many people can say they've seen snowflakes that actually look like snowflakes? <laughs> I think it's 
probably kind of a little bit rare unless you live somewhere that snows constantly. Um, it was just really cool. And I used some of those pink enamel dots from my mind's eye and I'm going to use this flare badge um, that's kind of a gray and it has a pink or it has a camera on it with a pink center. Um, it's a little bit maroonish actually. It's not exactly pink but it was close enough. I'm not sure where I got that actually. Wouldn't surprise me if it was maybe something Studio Calico, but uh, don't quote me on it. <laughs> um, so I'm doing my journaling on this white cardstock and I'm gonna cut it into strips. Ew, oh, Layla turned my light off. <laughs> she, was, she was running around while I was scrapbooking and she literally came into my room and turned off my light. I was like, what are you doing? <laughs> oh, that child, I swear. Okay, so I have my journaling done and I'm cutting them into three strips. And when I put them down, I realized they kind of need to stand out a little bit more. So I'm going to take an ink pad and um, just ink the side, ink the edges of it in black. It's a very subtle ink edge, but um, it's enough to make a difference. And I'm watching something. What am I watching here? Oh, I was watching Justified, and uh, it was a pretty good part, so I was getting a little bit distracted. <laughs> I love that show. I'm completely caught up on that, so I think I was watching the most recent one on my iPad at that time when I was doing this page, so. Completely caught up on it, and I'm upset it's the last season. I love that show. And I'm looking at this and I'm thinking I need some more stuff. Um, especially on the left hand side, it's looking, I mean, it's not bare by any means, but like right above the card and maybe a little bit below, I'm kind of thinking I need, I need one or two more elements here. So I'm kind of just looking around my desk to see what I can throw on here. <laughs> Cause there wasn't anything in my kit that I hadn't really used already or that would go with the layout. Um, Oh, but first I'm going to back this on a piece of black cardstock. So I am going to do that first. I felt like it needed to be grounded a little bit more. Yeah, I like the way that looks a little much better. I'm going to look at it for a minute or two and then um, I'm going to add, I believe, two more things on here that are sitting on my desk. I'm gonna go through, this is a little freckled fawn tin that I have sitting on my desk of stuff that I'm gonna be trying to use up here soon. A lot of it is freckled fawn stuff. Some of it is other things, but most of it's freckled fawn from my kids. So I put it back, I'm gonna go back to it though because I actually do want to use one of those wood veneer that I had looked at. Um, this is a white glitter arrow from freckled fawn. And I'm gonna pull this wood veneer out here and I'm gonna put that along the bottom. And I think that that um, helps tie it all together. I pulled something else out too, but I put it back. I don't even know what it was. <laughs> and that's it, that's gonna complete my layout. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, look closely for those pictures. Can you see them? Aren't they amazing? Okay, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Have a great day, and I will see you again real soon. Bye.